welcome back to Pearls SFL. Remember to check out the website www.superfightleague.com for all the fighter intros, the schedules and the updates. Well, time now for the opener. We begin all the action with the battle of the Atty Dudes. Now, let me explain. Nikhil walks around like he's rocky. And Emitesh walks around like nobody in any category in the entire MMA world can beat him. So they both have the kind of attitude going on is why we call them the Atty Dudes. Well, they both uh, have a successful amateur kickboxing career for the last four or five years, and they both have trained really well to be well-rounded MMA fighters. But obviously, only one can win tonight. So which dude will that be? Only one way to find out. Let's go to the Ozone, over to Keith. <laughs> The first night, the first fight. But are you ready? Yes! Let's do this! Two fighters in the lightweight category, going elbow to elbow, toe to toe. Please welcome, firstly, Amitesh Chobi. We are live here at the SFL Center at SFL 20, welcoming Amitesh Chobe at the Mountain Dew Fighter Prep Point. Dar ke aage jeet hai. My name is Amitesh Chobe. I am from Lucknow. My age is 22 years old. My MMA record is to win. Nick's master art is not easy to do. For being an MMA fighter, you have to do a lot of work. मैंने सच कहूँ तो बहुत मेहनत किया है इस जगह पहुँचने के लिए। फाइटर सभी जीतने के लिए खेलते हैं। मैं भी उनमें से हूँ। मैं उसे इतना मारूँगा, आने वाले समय में एमए में खेलने से पहले वो दस बार सोचेगा। Well, after that interesting BT, we can say that he's ready. And the next fighter, his opponent, in the red corner, put your hands together for Nikhil Park. <laughs> Nikhil Park has his work cut out for him here tonight. He takes on the dangerous Amitesh Chobe. Nikhil Bhatt coming back after a long time at his performance at SFL 8. He lost in his debut to Sachin Bhatt. He is at the Mountain Dew fighter prep point. Dar ke aage jeet hai. I'm Nikhil Bhatt from Chandigarh. I'm 20 years old. जब मैं 19 इयर्स का था तब मैंने एमएमए चूज किया। ये मैं जीतना मेरे बहुत इम्पोर्टेंट है क्योंकि मैं अपनी जो रिस्पेक्ट है वो फिर अंदर ना आता हूँ। तो मैंने पिछली फाइट में गवाई थी। वितेश बच के आया ना लास्ट टाइम मैं यहाँ से हार के गया था। अब मैं यहाँ से जीतने के लिए आया हूँ। He lost first at SFL8 against Sachin Bhatt and surprisingly both by submission. What changes has he made ever since? It's been a long time since he fought here. Here we go to the table of tape. Our first fight of the evening at SFL 20 is in the lightweight division. We've got Nikhil taking on Amitesh. Both fighters are young. Amitesh, 22 years old, the older. They weighed in on approximately the same weight. Slight height advantage goes to Amitesh. And the experience falls in favor of the Lucknowite. Here are the rules of the Ozone. They are based on grappling, aggression, effective striking, and cage control. Three judges score the bout. Three rounds are five minutes each, unless there are championship rounds, which are five five-minute rounds. 
Rules of the Ozone also include a 10-point scoring system. The winner of the round gets 10 points, the opponent gets 9 points or less. The judges in charge of the fights here tonight, Rajesh Girme, the chief judge, Kushnur Jijna, Banji Mahida, Chetan Kinekar, and the commentators are two guys there, the, the best looking guys in the uh, SFL <laughs> arena, <laughs> Daniel Isaac and Arjun Chipalkati. Thank you, Dan. Oh, this night is only getting started. But first, let me introduce you to my two fighters. Fighting from the blue corner, his star kickboxing, weighing in at 70.86 kilograms. And fighting from Lucknow, Amitesh Chabi. And his opponent in the red corner, weighing in at 69.32 kilograms. His fighting style kickboxing, representing Chandigarh, Nikhil Bhatt. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, your match referee. Mr. Ryan Thorpe. Referee in charge for this fight tonight is Ryan Thorpe. Follow my instructions at all times. Okay, on a clean fight. Last minute fight start, instructions start, for both the fighters. Over. Look at that stare down, Dan. Yeah, there was uh, quite an interesting stare down at the weigh-ins. Uh, both these guys, I think, will waste no time. Nikhil Bhatt, Amitesh Chobe. We are ready for our first lightweight fight at SFL 20. Judge, judge, time. Ready, ready, fight. Here we go. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the Super Fight League and these are two of the most exciting fighters in the lightweight category. Nikhil Bhatt in the red trunks, Amitesh in the blue. Amitesh has uh, just come off of a uh, two-month training preparation for this bout. Nikhil Bhatt has just come off a, a couple of bouts at uh, SFL Contenders uh, preparing. Uh, Amitesh uh, chose to prepare in the, in the, in the gym and uh, Nikhil preferred to uh, prepare in the cage. That's very interesting theory, Danny. We've spoken about this so many times before. So many fighters have made the choice to train on their own versus actually training with an MMA camp. But yeah. ever since Amitesh is like, what, two and two in the SFL? He's won as much as he's lost. I think he's learned a little bit after that, hasn't he? Well, uh, interesting to note, as the bout began, I thought I saw Amitesh's ankle twist. Uh, I, I hope that's not going to cause uh, an Gone issue the with, uh, with the way he continues the fight. Oh, I think we need Time. to see a replay. Maybe that knee by Nick Hill landed a bit low. Fine. Yeah, that, that was a very interesting move, Arjun. It was a scissor flying knee, left knee to the groin. <laughs> I need to figure out how uh, Nickelba did that because that's a great self-defense uh, move. Well, Amitesh seems fine. If he gets hurt, you're going to get out of unfortunately Jeffrey for Ryan. yeah, unfortunately <laughs> yeah. for Nikhil, this isn't self-defense. This is mixed martial arts, and there are rules and regulations in the SFL Ozone. <laughs> well, they restart. Both fighters touch. Well, again, they tried touching gloves, but that didn't happen. Nice left hook by Nikhil. Uh, Amitesh's cornerman, uh, Alan Fernandez, is shouting, this is what happens when you don't begin first. Both fighters scrambling. Both swung and missed. I think Amitesh just made a sign there that perhaps Nikhil's fingers might have just gone into his eye by mistake. Yeah, you know, um, Arjun, there, there are many times, you know, me being a fighter myself, uh, early in my uh, kickboxing career, I also remember there are times that when, when you fight and you just can't get the rhythm, you know, it, it takes a few minutes sometimes, you know, 30 seconds for you to kind of get your rhythm and that's when you're ready to go guns blazing. You know, there's, there's so much of preparation, so much of hype for these guys, but it uh, looks like both of them haven't got their rhythm to start the fight. Not yet really, they're spending uh, a good amount of, they spent almost two minutes sizing each other up. They're taking their time, all right. But you can see Nikhil Bhatt has started uh, throwing a few feints out there. He missed with a couple of those left and right hands, a spinning back kick as well. And there we go, another a front kick. Oh, that almost Nikhil Bhatt has got his uh, left hand up there because he's expecting the right high kick or, of Amitesh Chobe. Amitesh, oh, wow, that was a fastball of a right hand. Nikhil clinches immediately. Lands a nice knee. We don't know if that hit low or was it on the mark. 
but a good knee nonetheless. Good control being shown by Nikhil. Nikhil uh, was prepared for the takedown. He sprawled, uh, but he's as usual is going for that uh, neck and shoulder grab, which isn't going to do too much. Amitesh uh, pressing his the fighter up against. Yeah. Amitesh is uh, yeah. I, I haven't seen the real Amitesh oh! yet. And there are a couple of yeah, a couple. Uh, there was a right hook that landed on Amitesh's head. A right and a left. <laughs> there was a good break by Nikhil. The minute they broke, he swung for the fences. A minute and 34 seconds remaining in the first round. He's got a body lock. He's looking to throw him. Good defense by Amitesh. Amitesh's corner man going crazy, calling for Amitesh to land that left hook, right straight combination. But you see, Dan, he's, he's struggling. He's been struggling to get off the fence. Every time Nikhil pushes him up against the fence, he's unable to reverse position. Nikhil still has an underhook on the left side. One Amit minute more in round one. Amitesh looking to trip him. Oh, and he gets it. Whoa, whoa, whoa look at this. Nope. Reversal. Nikhil in half guard. Now Amitesh pulls it back to full guard. A very uncomfortable position for the fighters and the audience as well. Amitesh was looking perhaps for a, a leg lock there. 35 seconds in the first round. Nikhil stands right back up. Well, first fight of the night. Looks like it's going to go to round number two, but I have been wrong in the past. Ah, uh, the timekeeper's called 10 seconds. 10 seconds. Well, hopefully both these guys will get a slap from their corners each to come back and so, put up a better fight. Gregor finishes that round with a nice leg kick. And we go to round number two. Interesting first round for both the fighters. Yeah, interesting to note that uh, Amitesh seemed like he wanted to take the fight to the ground. Uh, Nikhil Bhatt was uh, ready for that takedown and uh, at one occasion no, he, certainly was, yeah. Yeah, he actually reversed uh, Amitesh's takedown. Um, difficult to score the first round. No, um, I, I, it's, uh, I think I would, I would give it to uh, uh, the red corner. Uh, you know what? If, if I had to, I wouldn't give it to either one of them. <laughs> well, <laughs> no one won that round. No one. Well, maybe it's a wig. You know, it's always the first round, and sometimes fighters take time to warm up. Amitesh certainly looks like he has a bit of a spring in his step as both fighters get ready for round number two. Yeah, we're eagerly awaiting for this fight to begin. Time. Ready! Lovely cheerleaders. Ready. The SFL Ozone Girls are back. For those of you who are coming for our real audience. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, if you're just joining us. Here we go, round two. Nikhil Bhatt is in the red trunks. Amitesh in the blue. Oh, beautiful Superman punch! He landed that clean. Wow. Yeah, looks Nikhil like is hurt. Yeah, looks like uh, Alan Fernandez landed that slap on Amitesh when he went back <coughs> after the first round. Oh, he's already got a cut. Oh, oh, head kick. And a head kick. Wow. Oh, he's hurt. He's hurt bad. He's landed Nikhil that shot. Is a love That was a, a solid shot there. Amitesh needs to swarm on him. Wow. Amitesh, Amitesh needs to swarm him in right now. He's got Nikhil but hurt real bad. Beautiful yeah, Superman Amitesh punch. smells blood. Amitesh smells blood. Hooks, hooks, left, He's landing right, those shots. The body. Beautiful shots. Landing the body. those shots. Body shots are going. Body Heart shot. shots oh, are going. And the fight over. is over. Wow. Beautiful right hook. Amitesh Chobe has That's won <laughs> that bout. Landed that beautiful right hook at the end of it. And that's all she wrote. Wow, man. <laughs>
What a matchup! Woo! Boom! Well, we have a winner by technical knockout in the second round in 59 seconds! In the blue corner, Amitesh Chavez! Okay, let's talk to this guy here. Amitesh, what was your strategy? Did you think that I would go to the first round, go to the first round, go to the first round, go to the second round, go to the second round, and then go to the second round? Was that your strategy? Really? I thought it was a good thing. But what I thought was, I thought it was Aaron Sir. I want to play with them, Philal. I want to play with them. And I want to say that until their hands are in my hands, until their hands are in my hands, I don't want to kill them so much. That sounded like a girlfriend. In my hands, in my hands. Well done, Alan. Well done, Amitesh. The opening season winner. Give it up in the blue trunks. 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 Dan, when you see the highlights here, beautiful right hand by Amitesh. He started his attack. Both fighters scrambled. Round one consisted of a lot of cage work, some takedowns, but this was it. Left hook, right hooks, body shots. He hurt him, I think, a couple of times with those body shots. The first two shots were the ones that did the actual damage. See, again, straight to the body, beautiful shot to the head, and that's all she wrote. Right hook, and your winner by TKO, Amitesh Chobe. Well, that was a quick opener for tonight. Keith, which dude were you rooting for? Well, to be honest with you, I wasn't really taking sides. When I started off, there's a guy who's an absolute novice. He's got one fight under his belt. Amitesh is the more experienced one. And honestly, tonight, he used that experience. And Alan trained him really well. He waited it out in the first round. He was patient. He was easy. He played on the crowd's energy. He used that in the second round and came out, boom! He was right I there. think the crowd was definitely loving the uh, energy, cheering Amitesh on. And that little hip move and the swirl he did at the end, let's call it his victory dance, was quite something the as one well. One punch of his really took everything down. Absolutely. I, I think before he had uh, this fight of the night, he had two wins before this one. And that's something that went into three rounds against Saeed from Iran. And that was fight of the night. And here, he couldn't have asked for anything more. He did it again. So congratulations to Amitesh. What a start of a night, huh? I know, and it's only going to get better. Do you know why? Tell me. Because <laughs> it's Jason Ramirez Solomon taking I knew you were say that. after. That man is stylish. The kind of entry that he brings us tonight, I doubt it will be matched by anyone else. So look forward to that one. He will be fighting Mukesh Gora, and that's right after this break.